In this video, I'm going to explain why you should consider using an even roll putter for your next putter. Now, I'm coming from a Scotty Cameron, which is widely regarded as one of the best putters out there, and I fully agree that they are up there. But I think the technology within the even roll for me is more compelling, and we're going to get into that right now. The first thing to note, we'll start with the outside here. The even roll symbol here, it's an E, but also if you turn it like this, this is the putter face. And this is explaining the technology, whether you hit it off the center, the heel, or the toe, the ball is going to go about the same distance. So nice leather putter cover. And then here is this plush interior. So I have an ER2, 370 grams, made in the USA. This putter has been incredible. So the technology that Even Roll has here is they've weighted the putter, and this is a face balance putter, this specific one is, meaning when I hold it in my hands like this, mainly the face is looking straight up to where if I have like another putter like this Scotty Cameron, if you wanna see the refinish video I did on the Scotty Cameron, I'll have that link down in the description. But when I hold that in my hands like this, you can see the toe faces down, so just a different weighting system. For me, with the even roll putter, my putting stroke is very square to square, so for me, that's a better fit. With this putter, I've legitimately felt that I've made more putts because I don't have to worry about hitting it absolutely square every single time. A lot of the reason people are missing putts a lot of time is because of speed. You're not getting it there, you're hitting it too far, and this for me has just, it's helped. If you make one more putt around, that is so helpful, and that's why I highly recommend these things. So we're gonna hit a few putts here. Unfortunately, if you're like me, if you're a left-handed player, they don't offer many options, and I wish that they would offer a blade option because I would rather have that over a mallet. This is as close as I could get to that. And also like a look at the sight lines here. So you have these two dots, and then you have this white sight line here, and you can also get this in black, like a satin black finish, which is really nice. And I also have this thicker grip on it, which I also like, 34 inch putter. I just really love this thing. And like as much as it's cool to have a Scotty Cameron, that's like arguably one of the coolest putters to have, this for me, I'm making more putts and that's what matters at the end of the day. As far as feel goes, very soft face and easy to align. And also these two sight lines, I can really focus in, okay, that's where I need to have the ball centered and make a nice stroke and leave it a foot and a half short. But yeah, I just, I can't recommend this putter enough. Go to your local wherever, pro shop, PGA store, see if they can get in an even roll or if they have one, try it out. Cause I think you'll be really impressed with just the feel and build quality of these putters. Now, there's a lot of putters out there that are great. I just really believe in even rolls technology, even though I'm uh, consistently missing this 12 foot putt here. But out on the course, I've made a lot more putts. My speed has been more consistent and I highly recommend it. So again, whether you're hitting a putt here, here or here, it's gonna be more consistent. So that's why I think you should check this out before going into a store and be like, oh, I'm just gonna go get this random Odyssey or something like that. I feel that this will actually help you make more putts. It's not gimmicky. These are expensive putters. And there's also tour pros that are using these. Anytime I see a tour pro using some equipment, whether that's shoes, minus when Bubba Watson used Volvic crystals and his, his career just went awful for a year, switched back, world ranking just went like this. Yeah, other than that. But yeah, anytime you see a tour pro using something, there's two things that happen. Either it's tour proven or they got just paid an insane amount of money. In this case, these putters are excellent. I know Zach Blair was using one of these. I think Tony Finau was for a little bit. I highly recommend it. So that's, that's it, that's the video. Check out Even Roll Putters. I'm not sponsored or anything like that, but Even Roll, if you guys see this video, could you please, for God's sake, make all of your right-handed putters for left-handed players. I mean, if there's something I'm missing, I don't see why you can't just switch the mold in your CAD system to be able to make these left-handed, so. That's it. High quality putters by Even Roll. Thank you for watching. Like the video if you're still with me. If you have any questions on Even Roll, leave it down in the description and I'll be sure to get back to you. Oh my God, he just killed a bird. Really? Yeah. Oh my. I tell Andrew to film for one second and the guy murdered a dove. Oh. Hopefully it makes it. Brutal.